For God did not send His Son to condemn the world, but to save the world through Him. John 3, 17 For God did not send His Son to condemn the world, but to save the world through Him. John 3, verse 17 For God did not send His Son into the world to condemn the world, but to save the world through Him. Yay! Ang galing naman, kids! Can we all give ourselves a mighty clap? Huh? Mighty clap? Ano yan, Teacher Del? Well, ganito yung mighty clap. One, two, three, hu! Sige, gawin natin ang mighty clap together. Ready? One, two, three, hu! One more time. One, two, three, hu! Ayan, galing! A mighty clap sa lahat ng kids na nag-recite sa memory verse natin. Kahit hindi kayo na-feature this Sunday. Very good kayong lahat. Anyway, hello boys and girls and welcome to our children's message. Ako si Teacher Del and as always, I am very, very excited to learn with you today. Alam nyo ba, ano ito? Ooh, ano to? Well, these are paper clips. And let us put our paper clips inside this jar of water. Yan. We have our paper clips inside this jar. And we also have here a magnet. Oh, alam nyo ba yung magnet? Marami sa atin merong magnet na dinidikit natin sa refrigerator. Gaya nito. Ngayon, let's explore how the paper clips inside this jar of water react to the magnet. Let's see. <gasps> wow! Ano nangyayari? If you notice, the magnet has a great power that attracts many objects like this paper clip inside to itself. So kahit saan pumupunta yung magnet natin, dun din pumupunta yung mga paper clips. And this reminds me of something that Jesus thought about himself to the people. Kasi long time ago, akala ng mga followers ni Jesus that Jesus came here on earth to set up an earthly kingdom. Kasi nga, Jesus is a king. And people wonder because he didn't look like a king since he didn't wear a crown. Instead, he wore the same kind of clothes everyone else was wearing. He didn't live in a palace or a castle, but he lived in an ordinary house and often slept on the road as he traveled with his disciples. And he didn't even sit on a throne with lots of guards and servants watching out for his safety and well-being. So, when Jesus and his followers talked about the kingdom of heaven that Jesus was trying to talk about, they were puzzled. At hindi lang yun. Hindi lang yung mga followers ni Jesus ang nalilito, but even other groups of people. Kasi nga, Jesus is a king and why doesn't he look like a king? So they wondered and asked so many questions. Yet, Jesus answered them in a way which would not make sense to them at that time. Hindi nila maintindihan ano yung ibig sabihin sa mga sinasabi ni Jesus at that time. But it would become clearer in the very near future. Wow! And sabi ni Jesus, the hour has come for the Son of Man to be glorified. And he said some other things too, but not much of it made sense to the people who asked the question. They must have been thinking, Bakit hindi niya sinasagot yung questions natin? What's the big secret? His words can still puzzle us. But the truth is, Jesus came to earth to die for our sins so that we could join Him in His heavenly kingdom. Naalala niyo yung lesson ni Teacher Normie last time? That God loves us so much that He sent 
Jesus to die for us so that we can live with Him forever in His kingdom. And all we need to do is believe. And going back sa magnet natin, this magnet has a very strong drawing power that everywhere we try to move our magnet, the objects inside are attracted to it. Just like the drawing power of Jesus. When we see His great love, we are drawn to Him. He willingly died on the cross to pay the price for our sin. So again, believe. And we can start believing by trusting God. Trusting God doesn't mean we will never sin again. But rather, it means that even if we sin, we still know He still keeps loving us. His arms are always reaching out. He has the power to draw us back to Himself. Gaya nito magnet. And there is no power stronger than the love of Jesus. With this, let's all stand and let's sing and dance. It's about love. Come on now, let's open up the book. Come on now, and take a good long look. And see, God has given us all we need to be free. It's about you. to sing and dance that song because it reminds me so much of how powerful God's love is. Ngayon, let's have our memory verse. Let's get our Bible and buksan sa John chapter 12, verse 32. Jesus said, And I, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. John chapter 12, Verse 32. Again, ulitin natin. John chapter 12, verse 32. Jesus said, And I, if I be lifted up from the earth, will draw all men unto me. Let's pray. Dear God, we thank you so much for the unfailing love you have always shown us. Thank you for Jesus Christ who was lifted up so that 
we could live with you in your heavenly kingdom forever. We are so sorry for our wrongdoings, Lord God, and we pray that we will obey you the way you have taught us to be your sons and daughters. We thank you and we love you so much. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Bye kids! See you next time! Hello!